I think the alumni concert is a wonderful example of how legacy can really be seen because you have alumni coming back, giving up their time, their, their energy, um, uh, certain sacrifices in their own schedule and personal lives um, to raise money for scholarships for current students. So I think, I think it sends a great message community-wide what it means to do something in the present for the future. We're bringing in people from 26 years of the school's history and we're bringing in not just professional performers but we're bringing in business owners, moms, dads, teachers. We have a civil rights attorney coming in from Washington DC to be a part of this. So we really wanted to demonstrate to the students that Harrison alumni really do actively keep the arts as part of our lives. Coming here in my high school years gave me a chance to be around other like-minded, focused, arts-driven students. And then when I went into the professional world to dance, I felt like I had all of the pieces to the puzzle. I felt like I had experienced them to some aspect before and it was just a matter of being on a different stage. Perhaps the greatest thing about this particular event, despite the community uh, entertainment value and all of that, is that the proceeds are going to student scholarships, which again speaks to the commitment of the alumni. It's kind of you know, putting your money where your mouth is. You say this school means a lot to you, you say it was valuable education, how do you pay that forward? Well, they're doing this event, they're raising money, and they're turning it right back and giving it back to the current students, which I just think is such a great thing. The arts bring so much to a community. They bring a quality of living to, to a community that helps that community bring in professionals. It really elevates the quality of life. And I think part of what Harrison does for its students is empower them to take on roles of leadership in their communities, whether that be for the arts, for the business community, or any other part of that community. So I think it's a wonderful chance for the community to come out and see what Harrison's alumni have done whether it's in this community or out in the rest of the world. I say all the time that if you don't think there are arts and culture things to do in Polk County, well then you live under a rock, right? Because there really are. People like to kind of bad mouth it, but that's just not accurate. This is just one more event where people will get to see, um, quite frankly, the product of a Polk County education. These students went to Harrison, they're off in their professional careers, not all in entertainment, but many, and yet here they are coming back and showing this is the value of that, of that education. So I think it shows the community uh, the value that they're getting now with students by showing what the past students are ever able to do. So I do think it's not only, hey, come out and have, have a wonderful evening of, of community entertainment, but it speaks to what it means to have uh, an arts education available to the current students in Polk County as well. You do feel like a family once you've graduated here, and it's nice to come back to family. Um, as a selfish plug, I'm the MC. That ought to be worth something right there. You know, come see Dr. Ward make a fool of himself. Um, but, but it'll be a great evening, and I'm just excited, and I, I can't wait.